Hello and welcome to this AS Review Lab tutorial. Today we're going to talk about release 0.19 and I will show you today how you can work with RISC files, AS Review Lab and reference managers. So let's get started with the reference manager because that's the first part you need to do. So here on the, my screen you can see that I have a library called RISC before screening. Um, this is all you need to know here. We'll just export this file by right clicking your mouse and then going to export collection and then going to a RISC format. You just press OK and then it will download. That's all there is for the first part. Really easy, right? So let's see how it works in AS Review Lab. For the convenience of this tutorial, I already started a project called RISC. Here you can see the project and I already marked four papers as relevant and four as irrelevant. So that's, that's all you need to know for this project. So let's just download the results. And this is where the fun part starts. I can now finally download the RISC file. So first we had only CSV, TSV and Excel, but now we also have RISC. So that's the new part here. Super cool, I think at least. So uh, let's download this file. And as you can see, it already downloaded. It was very fast, but that's just the magic phase review. It's very fast. So um, let's go back to Zotero. And now we can see the file after screening. Um, to import, you can go to file and then import and choosing your file. Okay, so let's see what has changed. Well, it seems like nothing has changed, but that's all right because we want nothing to change except for one little thing. If you go to the notes field, you can see that there's a one everywhere. Well, what does that one mean? It means that there is one new note. So let's take a look at the notes and search for all AS review lower score relevant papers. And as you can see, there are four records. That's the same number as we saw in the AS review project itself. So that's correct and which is really nice. And then we go to search for the irrelevant ones. Those were also four. And as you can see, we also have four irrelevant documents. And this is all you needed to know to work with AS review lab 0.19. Thank you for tuning in and see you next time.